Police were called out after an inert nuclear missile was found in a man's garage. The missile was a little worse for wear though. The authorities were alerted after the owner of the missile attempted to donate it to a military museum. It's not unusual to find old car parts, rusted bicycles, old boxes, and other junk stuffed away at the back of someone's garage. To find a nuclear missile, on the other hand, is a different story altogether. When a man in Bellevue, Washington, recently offered to donate an inert nuclear missile to a military museum in Ohio, the first thing the museum did was call the police. When the officers arrived at the donor's home, they discovered that there really was an old rusted nuclear missile in the man's garage, though fortunately it was missing its nuclear warhead. The bomb squad was even called to the property to ensure that there was no danger to the public. According to a blog post on the Bellevue Police Department's web website, the donor of the missile had actually acquired it from his deceased neighbor who had bought it at an estate sale. Bomb squad members inspected the object and then learned that it was, in fact, a Douglas Air II Genie, previous designated MB-1, an unguided air-to-air -air rocket that is designed to carry a one and a half kiloton W-25 nuclear warhead, the department wrote. There was no warhead attached. The donor himself was reportedly extremely irated by all the media coverage received. Because the item was inert and the military did not request it back, police left the item with a neighbor to be restored for display in a museum, the department wrote. This is by BBC News on Unexplained Mysteries. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. I kindly support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.